so we're back. We said goodbye to Lisbon in 2018 and now we say Shalom Tel Aviv. The sun is shining, the sky is clear. It's so fantastic so far. We've just passed through security, there was no queue. We had accreditation yesterday, there was no queue. Everything works really nicely so far and we're really happy with that. So as you can see, we're on the other side of security now. You pass from the, the entrance to the arena complex. Accreditation hut is here, just in the foreground here. Walk up here and in through security and you're in. Thanks a lot and we'll carry we on We seem later. to have uh, tea and coffee huts here this year, these little truck things. We're not sure if that's free yet. I doubt it's going to be free, but we never know. With big Tel Aviv signs, beautiful surroundings. Everything's green, everything looks really nice. The press center is just literally here. So it's literally a two minute walk from, uh, from the uh, security hut and then you're indoors. So welcome to the press center, big signs so you can see where you're going. Unfortunately in Portugal last year we were lacking that so well done Tel Aviv so far that's been really good. We already have some very keen press in the queue. Coming up here we have people from the Czech Republic, people from Norway and people from the Czech, no, Czech Republic as well. Okay so uh, guys first in the queue why was that? Give us a clue. Uh, uh, this is my luggage yeah, from the Czech. The yes yes. Okay so what are you expecting from Eurovision this year? Mm, I am expected uh, uh, Son? It's a difficult qu question. Okay. Joseph, I'll come to you. Uh, what are you looking forward to most this year? This year? Who is like, who are we rooting for? Yes. Well, my favorite is uh, Switzerland, Luca. Okay. Yeah. And coming over to Morton. Uh, what's, uh, what do you think last year Norway didn't do too well? This year they've got a bit of a banger. Do you think they're going to improve on that, that, that the seventh position last year? It was actually 15th last 15th? year. Oh, yes. okay, maybe no. No. Bad no. fan, no. bad fan. Come on. No, I hope so. I really hope so. We're okay. going to get better. Okay. We have more arrivals from the United Kingdom just turned up. So we have Robin and Hass here. Robin, welcome to Tel Aviv. How's it been so far? Well, I know this Tel Aviv because there's a sign over there, there saying that. Yeah. Big, big sign, isn't there? So well, how's it been for you so far? Well, me last night. Uh, and spend a fortune on it. Uh, okay. But apart from that, I'm settled. Yeah. We're here, the sun is shining, and you're here. Okay, cool. Has and for you, how's it been so far? Uh, so far, everything's running smoothly. We, we got here so far by any hassle, so that's a positive sign. Cool. Now, now we're getting very excited after the whole show itself and the rehearsals. Okay. You can tell how excited I am, can't you? And we have one of the gamblers coming up behind you. So, Gavin, come, come in. Come in, Gavin. Our professional gamblers. How are you this year? I'm very well, thank you. Yeah, has Loving the sun. Has yeah, I know it's, it's great. It's just the it? sun. Tell yeah. It's been okay for you so far. Yeah, every year, please. Perfect. Yeah. All right, thanks, guys. Check back later. So actually, inside the press center, not quite open yet. They only open at nine o'clock, but they very kindly let us in to have a look around. So, as you first come in, you've got a storage and lost and found area, which was quite useful if you're bringing your luggage from the airport, like the Czech Republic guys. Over here, it looks like we've got a snack bar and some relaxing area, which all looks quite pretty and quite nice they're still putting finishing touches to everything there's a welcome desk there looks like a nice photo wall here that might be a nice place to meet some of the delegations and do some interviews through there I guess is the working area we're not allowed in that area just yet but we will be in about 20 minutes or so Final stop on our very brief press center tour is we've come around to the working area so you come down from the uh, relaxation area down the steps and around into the working area which I have to say is pretty big enough this year and the security guys are saying hello hi welcome to Tel Aviv welcome yeah uh, how are you finding things so far has it been okay yes everything is okay yeah are you ready for the chaos of the next two weeks and all this random European press we are ready more than you yeah, I think I think so yes <laughs> thanks guys so we yeah, are walking through to the press working area as we blogs walk past me again and ignore me again come here Chris <laughs> Chris, you can't ignore me twice in right, one day. Run away, Say hi to I? everyone. Hello, ESC Cars viewers. Yeah, so we have Chris from Wimmy Blogs. Uh, Chris, yes. your whole team was here first thing in the morning. <laughs> and I heard you did a little bit of a walk this morning. Tell me about that. Oh, yeah. So it turns out that you can't just walk over a freeway in Israel, Why despite not? what Google Why Maps not? says. I know, right? I should be able to play small, right? frog, to Frogger if I want to. to and then we have Samantha Ross. Come in, Samantha. Come on. Just arrived hey. from the States. How are you doing? The incredible.
incredibly jet lagged, but I'm here. Yeah, jet lagged. It's okay. You can sleep tonight. I'll sleep when I'm dead. There's yeah, too much to do. Exactly. Poland will wake you up this morning. But guys, guys, guys. <laughs> most important of all, uh? sun. What that big gold disc in the sky and blue. It is, it's, it's it amazing, is, right? It is literally snowing in Minnesota this weekend. Oh, so oh this you know, is a miracle. Yes. Oh my God, yes. Okay. <laughs> guys, lovely to speak to you. Enjoy your f that two weeks yes. of hell. <laughs> yes. 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 So walking around, we've got plenty of desks. Uh, no LAN cables, which uh, is a little bit annoying, but yeah, we do have plenty of desks. One big huge screen there, which I assume we're going to be able to watch rehearsals on. Some little TV screens dotted around. One or two press here, ESU United, Wee Wee Blogs, The Gamblers, uh, the usual suspects. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that little tour around the press centre and we'll bring you some news from the interview rooms later on.